Hey guys, it's Superstar Gamer. Welcome back to more Paper Mario. In the last episode, we defeated Lava Piranha and rescued Miss Star. In this episode, we rejoined Princess Peach. Hey Tweet, would you, how'd you like sneaking out of here again? Shall we try? Princess Peach, you got so bold. And you're acting like you were gentle and delicate. Oh, I, I am delicate. I'm behaving like a delicate princess, just like the ministers taught me to. I love to be delicate. With a heart at the end. Okay, okay, I believe you, Peach. You're the princess. Alright, let's go for it. Yeah, Peach! There's like some bold moments you can play the games that have Peach in it. Like, um... There's like one part in Smash Brawl in the story mode. It's like a giant explosion that's right behind her. <laughs> I call that bold. <laughs> and of course in the Mario movie, she's pretty bold. <laughs> Peach is an awesome princess, I must say. Okay, I'm gonna do some exploring because I think this room is where you gotta go. So, let's see. You can't go in there. Let's see here. Okay, this is where we found Gourmet Guy, which we found in Chapter 4 is interlude. Uh, let's see, around here? Okay, this is where we found the uh, mysterious treasure chest. I'm basically doing some exploring before we continue on. You know, just to be safe, you know? Or actually, I think it's the library that we went to, I believe. Let me go check real quick. Because I think this door is the library. Yeah, that's the library. We already been here before. And of course, the, if the guard sees you, you have to go back. So let's not mess this up. Use our cutting stuff. Like if we're a ninja. Okay. Stay behind the books. There we go. So we got that batch in that corner over there. If you remember during chapter two's interlude, I believe. You know, after we beat uh, the boss of chapter two. Okay, and I think beyond there is where we found the uh, Koopa Patrol and the Hammer Bro talking about Tubba Blubba. So I think that's about it. Wait for this guy to move it back. There we go, slip on through. And let's see. There's the guard. Gotta go behind the table this time. Stay behind the books and stuff in the face. There we go. Now we just gotta go behind those. And we're home free. So I was a bit wrong. There's another door downstairs which we have to go. So let's go from right to left. You know, just to be sure. Don't want to get caught by these flashlights. Let's see, I think that's the kitchen we went to already. Let's check this room. Hello? Is anyone here? Let's open up this cabinet. There's a toad in here. Oh no, I'm caught for sure. Huh? Where's the speed? You're okay. I like the stars. You're a toad for the castle. How long have you been hiding in there? Well, since Bowser took over, I was so scared of being caught that I jumped in that closet. I'm hiding here until Mario comes to save us all. Princess Peach, you ought to hide too. It's risky out there. Please don't take any chances. Okay, so that's totally found. But here's a treasure chest that contains the last stand badge. We'll be sure to put that in the mysterious church chest. So there's the kitchen door that we went to. There are chapter four such a lose, remember? And then there's this door. It's locked, can't open it. Of course, being a key. So it's this door over here. That's where we gotta go. That's inside. And oh no, a guard! It's Princess Peach! How'd she get out? King Bowser's really gonna flip his wig if we don't take her back to her room. 
Now hang on just a second. Get a grip on yourself, okay? No need to panic. She can't get out of the castle anyway. And besides, what do you think about asking Princess Peach to participate in our little game? Cheap ideal, and we need a third person. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, you might be on the Silton. Hmm. Okay, let's do it. Princess Peach, you have been listening? Come this way. We want to tell King Bowser about your escape. If you help us with this little game you're playing. We're set up right over here. So we have a little game, apparently. Oh no, Princess Peach! A horrible disaster be awaits us. A quiz show! <laughs> Koopa Course percent. The 64 Trivia Quiz Off! I'm your host, Mr. Hammer. <laughs> so we have a quiz that we gotta play. Let's get right to it. Hey, I'm gonna ask you 10 questions and the contestant who gets the most right is our winner. Press A when you think you know the end. Okay, folks? The winner will get a gorgeous, fabulous prize go up to you all. Oh, and I've gotta tell ya, we're also giving prizes just for participating. So everybody will be a winner. That's just the kind of show we are. I like that, everybody being a winner. Okay, first question. Where's the name of the boss set of Boss Lava Island? That would be Lava Parada. <laughs> There's good part of funny questions, or funny answers rather. So it's Lava Parada, which is the boss that we fought back in chapter five. Next question. Where did Master Hoverboard put some star spirit? Ah, I thought I was gonna get it. Spiky Tom and Flower Fields. That's just the next area that we gotta go. I'm not for sure I was gonna get it. All right, question three. What's the name of the skate round monster in Georgia Ruins? That would be the chomp, because Koopa Troopas and Goobas aren't round. Alright, question three. You still have a chance to make a comeback. Well, that's question four. How do you get to flower fields? You pass the flower gate. Pretty cry. <laughs> like, I want to go to flower fields. Oh, wow, I'm already here. <laughs> Alright, pass the flower gate. That's the correct answer. Alright, next. Still in one's game. What's the person keep out really loves? Well, that would be Princess Peach. No, Peach isn't that too like Bowser. <laughs> Question six. Deep related to flower fields, well, that would be flowers. So that's that. Easy one. What's the name of the downright invisible cool guy? That would be Bowser, although this is basically like Mario's show. Because <laughs> this is Mario's game. <laughs> like, if it's not a Mario game without Mario, what do you expect to be? Alright. Next, ghosts that live in forever forest. That would be Boo, because ravens and tumble blubber aren't ghosts. I know that one for sure. Mm -hmm. Alright, we should remember this one. What's the name? Just out south of the post box office. Toe Town. That would be the flower gun. They're basically giving you all these answers to get the flower field to the next area. <laughs> so, there we go. And final question. Where's Peaches Peaches Castle now? But that would be on Bowser's castle in the groundwater. Never heard of that. And farthest of Shiver City. Shiver City is yet another area that we haven't been to yet. Kind of foreshadowing. But it's on Bowser's castle, and there we go. We got 9 out of 10 questions answered correctly. But we did one! Congratulations, speech is a prize. A jam and jelly. We'll never want to put that in the mysterious church chest as well. Thank you for coming, everyone. It's been grand. We'll see you next time at the Trivia Quiz Off. That's like a good name for a quiz show. <laughs> oh, Princess Peach. I always forgot. Here's your prize for participating. We got the sneaky parasol. A fabulous parasol given to a quiz show participants. This is a sneaky parasol. If you face so and press B, you can transform into that person. You just have to promise not to use it to sneak around. I mean, nobody will know you're Princess Peach, imagine. Sorry for giving you such a cool prize, Princess. <laughs> hey, it's only a prize for participating. So, what do you expect? What do you expect much of? Huh? What are you all doing? Hey, it looks fun. I'm gonna join it. Bowser didn't realize that the show is over. <laughs> but he does want to play. What? Before you finish off all the bottom stuff. Yeah! Princess Peach, what is she doing here? She sneaked out again. Urgh. You, take Princess Peach back to the room now! Yes, sir! 
sorry, Princess Peach. They don't want to hurt her, that's all. And back to the Mario once again. <laughs> Next to the star, we managed to escape from the volcano. Oh, woe is me, my beautiful treasure. Listen to you. No treasure in the world is more valuable than life. Be thankful you escaped. To think this island was put in terrible peril because of the familiar about men. I think it will work out. Okay. The eruption will subside and Lava Lava Island will be just the same as it used to be. But... <sighs> Sigh. Easy mode. <laughs> Dear Mario, you will saved five of the stars, guys. I know. Just a few more to go. My name is Miss Star. Let me grant you the power that will help you along. Alright, we've got Star Spirit Power number 5. Mario Star Energy goes up to 5. Mario can now use Smooch to use Star Spirit Power. With Smooch, you can restore Mario's HP. On the downside, it uses 3 Star Power, which is pretty expensive. But 20 HP, which is the exact total of HP you'll cover, is pretty worth it, I must say. Alright. Oh, I was so close. The treasure is right there. I dove to get saved and yelled at by some sort of moving great starfish. It's a star spirit, man. Come on. <laughs> okay. So, now all we gotta do is get the flower field. So, remember, we need all four seeds. So, back to Yoshi's village. And I know the general gist of where the treasure chest came down. So we had to go to the J jungle and go to where we encounter sushi. It's pretty simple enough. If you talk to that bubble, uh, he'll basically tell you that he got a seed ready for us. But he actually gave it to uh, Colorado. Okay, we have the volcano face, a treasure found inside Mount Lava Lava. Let's go give it to Crusher Colorado. He will totally want this, so that way his adventure will be complete. And uh, now that we're done with the chapter, I might as well rearrange my badges. I don't need ice power pouch fire shield anymore. So, let's see how equip. Uh, let's see. How about quick change? I might as well do that. And um, I'll keep hammer throw. Because I like hammer throw. The hammer throw badge is pretty good. And I'll switch to what? Alright, let's talk to Colorado and give him the volcano face. Mario, good heavens! It's the treasure! How on earth did you... Well, I suppose there's... That's no up to which this right now. You're giving it to me? Absolutely! You... You are giving it to me? Oh, joy, marvelous! Dear Mac, you are quite silly. The cat's meow. Cat's meow? I don't know what that means. <laughs> yes, I suppose it's only probably that, that I give you. Give this to you as thanks. The fourth and final magical seed. A seed. Have it planted in flower garden and tow town. A bubble gave it to me while I was off exploring. I'm sure it'll be quite valuable seed. I'm sure it's a quite valuable seed, but I'm not interested in it at all. Now that we got the treasure, I prepared this adventure to be a complete success. What a stupendous expedition! It'll be forever recorded in the history of archaeology. Oh boy, let's away. Back to the hotel with us. Absolutely. And I think, uh... I guess I don't eat this cake and... Still one point. Still start point away for reach our level. Hmm? Something smells really good. Is that delicious smell coming from something you're carrying? You're carrying? Whatever, whatever it is, I want to try it. Come on, what is it? Okay. This is what I was talking about. If you have... But uh, food prepared by Tasty, and give it to Yellow Yoshi and Lava Lava Island, you could trade it for yet another cooking ingredient. It's a melon! A succulent ripe melon which stores 15 HP. So yeah, you can actually get melons here by giving uh, the Yellow Yoshi a cooking item that you just made with, uh, well, with Tasty. Lava Lava just started erupting Mario. I believe that the volcano got angry because of Bowser's man for filling this from side. I'm glad you made it out. Thank you, village leader. Okay, time to say goodbye to well, Yoshi's village. I'm gonna... I'm gonna miss this place, but... 
Good on me. I, I, I do like Yoshi. He's like a great Mario character. Pretty sure he's downright popular, but you know. <laughs> and, okay, I just got these jungle things again. No, I'm gonna buy one. I'm gonna I'm gonna level up. Okay, there we go. I finished the fight. Now I actually leveled up. Okay, I'm gonna upgrade my FP. What about FP? Those jungle fuzzies keep spawning. They keep multiplying like crazy, man. Well, at least we won't have to worry about them anymore. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Watt again. I had to switch to bed because, well, what I said. Let's talk to the whale. You wanna go back to Toad Town? Yes, we're all done here. What a hell of your adventure. I do blah 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 island. Perchance someday I shall return to your shores. Ooh. Hey look, it's Junior Troopa. He had to swim all the way to blah 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 island. <laughs> yes, I <laughs> I did it! I swam all the way. Alright, Mario. Now I'm gonna give you a beer, you'll never What? Wait, where are you going? Wait, Mario, wait up! Oh, come back, can you chicken? Oh, shoot! Ah, the bright blue sea. Where all the citizens of Bikini Bottom lie. <laughs> I've been watching SpongeBob lately. It's a great show, I must say. Like I say, it's been around ever since, like, I think 1999 when the show came out. Man, it's. It's been a long time since that show came out. <laughs> Alright, we're back in Toad Town. Home sweet home. Nice, excellent expedition by Colorado, as he said. Thank heavens we arrived. Now, Tuna Bane is one experience I shan't do again. Cheers for the ride, Daryl. I'm in your debt. For now, I'm heading back to Cooper Village to relax. My life must be waiting for me there. I don't know. <laughs> Cross our passport across the end of the future, old boy. Cheerio! Cheerio indeed! <laughs> I'm not sure what cheerio means. Probably bye or whatever. Woo! Hey look, Jigga Trooper caught up again! <laughs> I will never swim again for the rest of my life. Now, Mario, you're mine this time! Alright, we're gonna fight Jigga Trooper again. Ah! <laughs> this is gonna be funny. <laughs> Here it comes! You, you better be ready! What this? <laughs> He's freaking out, it's on the HP bar going down! <gasps> oh no, hold that soon! My HP is almost gone! Oh, I'll make up for my low HP by using my new skill. Check this out! More power! Oh, now he has a spike and he can fly! He's basically a flying spike dead enemy! I know all your fighting powers now, Mario! You make it to spike the wings. You can't attack me. I'm the smartest fire alive. I can't be defeated. Wah ha ha. Well, guess what? Hammer throw. Right in your face. Yo, what is that? I didn't think you could do that. Is that even legal? You bet it is. Alright, um. Here's Mega Shock. I don't think I want to try that again. I'll try it on regular enemies, but let's do Electro Dash. Stop him! 5 HP! Ah! Of course, he's powerful! Alright, camera throw again! Fire! And now we can spray them all with what? Too easy! That is a piece of cake right there! He's down and out! Ooh. Oh, you know what? Now that I think about it, I have wings! If I had just flown in the island, I wouldn't have wasted my HP. I probably would have beaten Mario in no time. Stupid, stupid, stupid! Oh, we beat him. Ah! Yeah, you have to do that. Smack him with the hammer! <laughs> he totally deserved that. Okay, so. As you would guess, we're gonna do some side questy stuff and do some other things. I think we'll do a side quest in another time, like the next episode. Hey, look! Good boy and good mom. Oh, look at it, Mario. How would we see you? I came to go shopping today. It was a long walk to get here from the village. 
But it was good to see you. I was hoping to see Mario. Well, let's show him to Mario, shall we? He's really going right up. Mario, you're looking just fine, aren't you? You be careful not to be burdened in Mario's adventure. Hey, no way, I'm a burden. I have a lot of time. Well, I do. Mario is helping out the Green Mario. I'm so proud. I'm going to tell Dad and Koopa. Mario, you must come over to our house again someday. Come on, stop it, Mom. You're embarrassing me. I'm not okay anymore. Oh, don't be silly, pumpkin. I'm not saying anything embarrassing at all. I just love you, that's all. Can't the Mario be proud of her children? Oh, Mom, you always treat me like a you always treat me like a kid. Man, the yeah, Mario's getting scalded. Shut up, Gavaria. Ah, Mom, Mario's Gavaria's being mean. Sorry, it's just an embarrassing moment for Gavaria, I must say. Well, what's some you lose some? Okay, so uh, we got that letter from the radio she can. Might as well deliver it to him right now. And I guess I can show up this. I love little oinks. Love them. You know, you want to learn about them? Sure. Love little oinks. Little oinks are timid and mysterious creatures that hatch from eggs. They swoop easily and will run away if you approach them. we we'll serve them from, our, from out here. There may be some little oinks. They're very easy to tell apart. White ones, black ones, even gold and silver ones. If you're curious about the breed of good boy little oiks, come over to talk to me. I wish the world were full of little oiks. That would be grand. Alright, for 10 coins, you can uh, get an egg that will spawn a little oink. They're basically little pigs. And what they do is they give you items. I got a pink one. Let's talk to him. Ooh, it's a question mark little oink. How weird. Uh, I mean, how in interesting. <laughs> Well, let's do another one. Let's see what I get. Gold and silver are like pretty rare. If you get like a gold one and a silver one, you can get like an ultra shroom and a jam and jelly. I got a white one. Not too bad. Oh, it's a white little oink. So pale and dainty. Right, let's see here. Welcome to Toe Town's famous little oink farm. Yeah, we gotta get 10 coins. We can have a maximum of 10 little oinks on the farm. When the 11th little oink en enters, the first will leave. Now try to see all the ty different types of little oinks. So, yeah, what they basically do is they just give you different items. Gold and silver ones is what you totally want to get. Right, let's talk to this guy again. And you beat him, right? I guess he's talking about lava piranha that we totally defeated. What the happened? I don't know. Right, we got another letter for you, Dainty. Let's give it to him. Another letter totally delivered. A postman's job is never done. Wow, thanks a lot. You're much faster than the old postman, that's for sure. That Yoshi kid is a really good pen pal, huh? He writes really long letters. It sounds like there's always something fun going on over where he is. Lucky Yoshi. We should write back again. Hmm. What do you think we ought to write about? Hmm, I don't know. But think about it later. By the way, I want to ask you a favor, Mr. Parker. Can you deliver this? It's a letter from Uncle Frosty of Starborn Valley. We've heard of Starborn Valley before from uh, Muscular when Twink actually saw him. <laughs> He's my uncle. He's up there taking care of lots of star kids. It sounds like a hard job. He has chase him around all the time. At least that's what he says in the letters he sends. Anyway, I wrote him a letter to take his mind off work. I know it's far from here, but I really appreciate it. Okay, so we got Silver City of Starburn Valley. Areas we haven't been to yet. As you would guess, they're after flower fields. Yeah, we're gonna go to the end of the game now. Alright, so uh, now that we got sushi at the party, we can actually get some other stuff, like, I know there's one star piece we can get at the beginning of, a uh, Toad Town, so we can just go there. We have to be over here, and yes, there's a little dock, we ride sushi across, there's a pipe there too, we'll go in there in a second. Jump off, and here's the star piece! I believe that's all the star pieces in Toad Town we can now get. 
and I'm pretty sure that's the final star piece of all of Toe Town. I don't know. Anyway, down this pipe. Let's go. We're in a new section of Toe Town Tunnels. You can only access with sushi. I have going all the way in. We have a super block. So let's see. Oh, freaking Mario. The Master Multi Bog, which is a power bounce for the Mario. Pretty nice, I must say. And there we go. He's gotten a lot stronger now, too. And, yep. Alright, let's go. Let's go to the uh, entrance of the Toe Town Tunnels. Where we, uh. Well, it's right between, like, uh, the train station where we have to take the train to George Young Outpost, I believe. And the next to Taste Tea's place. So, I'll meet you guys there. Alright, we're inside. So, head over this way. If you remember. Oh no, I went the wrong way. It's down here. Where we have to use the super boots. That dog we can use it sushi, but I wanna go this way first. Beyond the pipe that leads us to the uh, Boo's Mansion. We can now cross these blocks and. I thought that was a great jump. <laughs> Let's try this again. Jump, jump. There we go, super block. If you remember this back uh, before. Uh, let's upgrade Cooper. He'll learn Fire Shell. A flaming Shell attack that hits all enemies on the ground. Cooper will be helpful later on, too. There we go. Another primer to Ultra Rank. And now... Um... I think we should go to the next area. Get past that pipe and come back up. We'll do this dock in a little bit. Just add the... We can now get like most of the super blocks. We can now get an upgrade most of our party members. So let's go uh, this way now. We have to find the room that has the uh, metal blocks, which I believe we get by going to this pipe. And I think this is it. Let's hop across and wait for that to go down. There's the spiky Columbas. I don't think we got to fight them again because we're really powerful now. And I think... No, this is not it. <laughs> Forgive me, my memory's a bit fuzzy. I think it's down this way. Yeah, down this pipe, I think. Uh, let's see, there's the metal blocks here. Yep, found it. Whoa! There's a buzz wheel down there. Alright, let's get it. And I'll upgrade... Uh... I'll upgrade both. She learned fan smack. It's basically a more powerful version of her smack attack. And there we go. We got all of our prime members upgraded because we found a new super block. Alright, so. Uh, let's see, it's just uh, Car Carry and Bobette to upgrade the super rank as well. So, we got two prime members with the upgrade to uh, super rank. And, um, Firefields, we will be able to get more stuff there. So I'll go down this way, and now let's go to that uh, dock that we saw. I go in this way, and we just need to go down. Where it's just the sushi, because you know, it's a dock, we use it to cross the water. So let's go! And no spoiler or anything, but there's going to be a boss fight coming up, and we're supposed to fight him with sushi. Blooper! That's a big blooper, I must say. We have the super blooper! Probably the biggest blooper of all. Okay, um, I'm gonna switch to bow. I don't think he has any defense points. Okay, I'm gonna use power jump and smash him! And I might as well show off a fan snack. This is 5 of feet, which is pretty high. Here we go! Two damage all around! And I think it'll make enemies dizzy. I'm not sure. Haha! It is one big enemy, I must say. Alright, let's do power jump again. He's got 70 HP, which is kind of a lot. Alright, now with smack, we can now do 6 damage total. Like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, 6 damage total. Oh, I think it's charging up! Oh, it released uh, blooper babies. I think they're called. Yeah, baby blo blooper babies. Uh, times like these, I'll use Star Storm to get rid of them. Let's be 
you weak because they have six HP. So there we go. We should be able to take care of them now. All right, it's halfway gone. Go smack them to death. Smack the heck out of them. Slap them silly. Okay, what's he doing now? Oh, he's charging red. That seems like a good opportunity to like, uh, um, you know, use out of sight. So let's do it. Out of sight. I'm invisible. I don't have a repel gel, but whatever. Okay. We'll turn it back to normal. And let's jump again. Jump! Whoa! And here comes the. Oh! Ink attack! <laughs> and. Okay, I'll have to go smack him again. Here it goes! 11 HP, almost down to the wire. Blue power jump. Whoa! 5 HP to go. I'll have a uh, bow finish them off. And of course, spawn blooper babies. Um, I'm gonna show how smooth. She's 3 star power, but it will cover 20 HP. Let's give her a try. Give us a kiss on the cheek, and there we go, 20 HP recovered. Alright, Bo, finish off the super blooper. And I think we have to fight the blooper babies as well. I'm not sure they'll go down. Let's see. Got a bunch of star points. Oh, man. Okay, the blooper babies are like the fuzzies. They can suck up our HP. Can't let them eat us. Alright. I guess we have to fight the Blooper Babies. I'll do power jump. Go! There goes one, and now let's take out the other. Take that! Done and done. Okay, that does it for this guy. We got 26 star points! Whoa! And that does it for the Super Blooper. Thumbs up. And let's hit this. We have our new pipe. It will take us to Yoshi Village on Lava Lava Island. So you can now come here anytime without using the uh, the whale. <laughs> okay. Uh, this way. I think it's another area we have to go through. Yeah, it looks like we're later. Oh, come on! Okay, I'm just gonna rough this pipe. Okay, we're good. This is another area we can access to. Uh, oh, come on! Why don't I give you a first strike with these dark Koopas? I really want to fight them right now. And of course, I'm just downright weak. Alright. Here we have a question block, but we're not able to jump high enough. As you expect, there's gonna be like a jump upgrade now. Would you expect that? And if we use watch here. Oh, come on. Yeah, there we go. We got these hand blocks that contain some stuff. Let's get another area for hand blocks. Yes, matter of fact, I found where we have to go. And we have this room. Um, see an empty room and a dead end? Use bomb down on this wall anyway. There's a secret hole. And here's this guy. Well, well, look here. Hello, hello. Rip Cheeto at your service. You're quite an enterprising fellow. Find this place. What am I doing here? Just doing a little business and money my own. Yes. So this guy has a deal for us. It only costs 64 coins. Let's buy it. We got a star piece. He has like three star pieces. And the price is the same, 64. But I don't think I want any more items. He does have pretty good items, but... After like a few other buys, he'll give you like dried shrooms and stuff. Alright, here's a odd key. And let's just on this lock. And check this out. It's the house that we couldn't open before. Nice shortcut to get to the Toton Tunnels where uh, Ripchito is. Really cool. Okay, so. Uh, we got this. We have Minty. Bobo's come from a flower field land called Flower Fields. 
They say the fire and flower fields are in trouble. To get the flower fields, you need four kinds of seeds that only bubbles possess. But where are the bubbles? Please, Mario, you must look for the bubbles to get the seeds for them. Maybe my own fortune telling will could help you look. We have already have all four. So, yeah, you have to have all, you know, all four of those seeds to get access to flower fields. But we're not going to do that quite yet. We might as well do some preparations and do some side quests, which we'll do in the next episode. So, next time on Paper Mario, we'll do just that. See you next time!